Because right now it just smells like pineapple. Oh, pineapple. Is he gonna squirt things? No. And that's just a Garney Weaver. And then Alien Mike. Didn't cut it right. Tried, but didn't cut it right. You're supposed to, if you get it at the right spot, it's supposed to just open. Open, yeah. I thought I had it at the right spot. I mean, I had it as best as you can tell at the right spot. I think it is, it's still frozen in there. It's so cold. That's yeah. Cool. I want that. Don't give me that piece. Open it up. Yeah. Hmm. What kind of it musk does it have? It kind of smells like rotted durian. <laughs> It's like a cross between garbage and gasoline. So it smells like San Pedro. Yeah. Yeah. Getting very close there. Yeah, it's, it's much stronger than it was right there. No, it's thawing. No, it's, it's it's being corrupted by oxygen yeah. in the air. It smells good. That's because you like Japanese food. What's this? What, compare what Japanese food item does it smell like? <laughs> like a me? monkfish bladder. Mm. Oh yeah, definitely monkfish bladder. Yeah, I mean, it, it smells good, but then there's that like, like smell of gasoline mixed in with the smell of good. Who's so gonna taste it first? All right. Uh -huh. Shopper minty. Um, Is that pretty fresh or? It tastes bad. <laughs> <laughs> but not like too bad. Alright, who wants to be the second taster? You ready? It tastes kind of like it smells. I'm just gonna gulp it down so you don't taste it. Mm. Does it have a mature flavor to You're it? Right, because it, it tastes a little bit onion. Yeah. Yes. It's onion fruit. It's like onion and gasoline. Like Vidalia's or. Okay, I'm about to taste it. I'll taste it but not waste it. It's more the look that gets me. I'll it's try it but not buy it. Yeah, it looks like, it looks like, uh, it looks like an organ. Yeah, it looks like an organ or a raw chicken. <laughs> Immediately going back for more. <laughs> Are you, is it an inconclusive taste or is it like, mm, this is so good, I need to have more right away? I'm trying to overload. You're trying to drown out the bad taste with more bad taste? I'm trying to like, just... Lit coat my my buds. I could sense the pleasure potential in there. Potentially euphoric effect afterwards. I'm just wondering I'm getting if, if weird, gasoline if I wasn't smelling I'm, gasoline. I'm getting a sensation of that that fumes going up to the, my the, nose and it's the texture is like very good. It's a very good custard. Now that's mushy. It's kind of banana banana dish. I could picture myself if I was a monkey wanting to eat this. <laughs> yeah, but would you be able to open it? Yeah, that's what monkeys' hands are made for. Orangutans.
you know, the orangutans. orangutans excuse me. Well, it's, it's I, think, I think you should make a smoothie. I'm afraid of like wasting the milk. Facial reactions. This is the king of fruits. It's not like I have crap on my fingers and I'm so horrified by it. Yeah, it's not. It's just like, oh, I don't want them to smell like that. I, I'd prefer to wash them. It's a smell that's like pleasant sometimes and not pleasant the other time. It's like it alternates or something. It's weird. It's not really alternating for me. <laughs> just like not particularly pleasant, but. Like if someone was sleeping and you shove this in their nose while they're laying there, don't think they would wake up in horror. I think they'd just be like, why are your fingers that? Eating is just like an orangutan eats it. What do you think, Ben? Well, it comes right off the, the nut, too. Falls off the bone? Yeah. That's the way they eat it down south. I guess it's not the most, pop most popular place to eat this in the world, but it just happens to be where the ones you get in America that can come from the Thailand's. I was looking at it on Wikipedia. I gotta try the monkey style. There's the sign on the Singapore trains that says, it's like, no no smoking, no drinking, no, no durians. Yeah. I'll have to ask my friend about that. My friend was a cop in the Singapore police. Yeah. <laughs> no spitting, no chewing chugged. gum in Singapore. Yeah. It's not like rendering, though. You need to render this fat. I feel this like this is you think so? You think yeah. it's got psychedelics? It's got it's got some sort of effect. Psychotropic. It's affecting my brain, yeah. Are you hallucinating? No, I just like kind of feel a little dizzy, like kind of like um. You eat like one millimeter of it. Like if you like breathe a lot, like hyperventilating. <laughs> really? Yeah. It's just because you need to eat more. It's the fumes, the gasoline fumes going up to my brain. I <laughs> really? figure out what it is. If Funyuns was a fruit, this would be That's it. it. That's <laughs> it, exactly. Yeah. Hey, this part's tough. I can't eat it. It's like... But... Chimps, chimpanzees could probably eat it. I'll, I'll, I'll drink one. Yeah, for sure. Oh, you got some? It's pretty good, I think. Mm -hmm. as, a, as a fruit, like, I wouldn't, I just wouldn't call it a fruit. I would call it more vegetable. Why? It's you mean like, taste-wise or... or? Taste-wise. Like, texture-wise, it's more of a fruit. It's like weird. It's like one of those things like... So you're going to defy science. It's like an avocado. <laughs> it's like an avocado where it's like... Yeah, like a tomato. It, where it should, yeah, where it should be a fruit and a vegetable or like those things, those naranja things. Like an orange? Naranja is an orange in Spanish. No, I'm thinking of this thing. It's like a cross between a mango and a tomato. Oh, okay. To mango? It's like, yeah, it's like a tomato. Tomato? <laughs> Don't put too many of these ice cubes in it. It'll like water it down. That's the way we have, eat it, it's a job. I know, the first ingredient does say buffalo. The second one is beef, and the third is water from Niagara Falls. There's no such thing as buffalo in the United States. People call it buffalo, it's really bison. It's American bison. Really? Yeah, it's not actually buffalo. You've never Buffaloes seen are buffalo from in Africa. my life. Buffaloes are from Africa. Yeah. American bison, they, it's the newest rage. They have all the ranches, they, they got bison now. Oh, yeah. What people call it buffalo, isn't that queer? I want one of those sticks. I'll give you one. It cleanses your palate quite well after this. It's like mm. part of the fruit didn't get ripe or something. Oh, that's all. That's all it is. That's all it is. Mm. The problem is there's no way to know, you know, because it's that frozen kind. So basically all our eggs are in this basket. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I like it tasty. I, I, I like that too a lot. That means you're ready for the next level. Good taste. And the next level is like uh, fresh ones. And then you gotta go to like Malaysia or, or something and get like the kinds that are actually just be good. Not the low grade strains of the plant. You have to get like the proper delectable gourmet. I know, they, they use it for medicinal effects, don't they? And what they, kind of medicinal they, effects they, do you think? You know, for strength and stuff. For strength? Like strength for poi ball balling? Yeah. <laughs> erectile not. strength or who knows? No, no, I'm not getting any erectile effects. That's right. what most fruits are used for. <clears throat> you can put some chili pea in this or something? Yep. What's this little thing? 
this That's nougat. The seed right there. We're gonna we're gonna start um, growing our own after this. Nice. If you were tiger, you would eat that, and then you'd crap it out later, and that's how you spread the durian plant across the, eat it? the Asian continents. Tigers eat it. Everything. Why wouldn't anyone want to not eat it? There they are. Is this made by Cuisinart? Yeah. You know, Weird Al has a song about Cuisinart. Call it Doreen, Doreen, pictures of Doreen yes. Way. Vastrovia, Skol, Kampai, etc. Cheers. <laughs> Is it like any of it can make it into my mouth? <laughs> <laughs> it was better just as a fruit. Because <laughs> we have super sugar in it, man. Sugar makes everything sweet. That's why they call it sugar. That's what I was saying. Right. Texture. It's banana and onion. That's what it is. It's a banana and onion shake. You feel the dizziness? It has a, a very awesome creaminess that banana can have when it's mixed with milk. Kampai. For your milkshake. I think this would grow on Do you. Do Chug it like Paul Charter. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna drink it like Hulk Hogan eating and drinking a raw egg. <laughs> Any taste, it'd be fine. That's its signature. Yeah. Flavor. Yeah. Does it does it give you the same properties of an onion, like of eating an onion? Which is what like it makes you, like makes the mosquitoes stay away from you and stuff like that. Probably right. Try it. Go outside. 